Hello and welcome everyone to Super Smash Brothers League uh, Playoffs Week 6. I'm Snuffy Sam and I'm joined today by my co-host Jack. Hi everyone. And yeah, um, this is the final week of the playoffs before the championship match. Yeah, it's going. It is Classic Mode Champions versus Third Wheelers to see who gets to face off against Musketeers in the finals. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and uh, I mean, my, both of these teams have already lost to Musketeers, so it's it's going to be interesting to see uh, who who's the better matchup against each other, and uh, whether whether that's going to be enough to face the terror that has been Musketeers this playoffs. Yeah, I mean, Musketeers have really just shown, I mean, they've been pretty dominant in every match they had to have during the playoffs, and so really, both of these teams are going to have a tough fight with whoever wins. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, I suppose um, I suppose uh, we'll, we'll get into it. Uh, match one, and the only match. <laughs> it's a very long week. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, this is going to be a pretty short stream. Uh, match match one, uh, and also the final match of the week, um, <laughs> is going to be Third Wheels versus Classic Mode Champions. Um, yeah, I mean, these are very interesting teams. I'd say Classic Mode, Classic Mode Champions has been super consistent. Like, their worst characters are better than a lot of teams' best characters. And their yeah, best characters I, are really good, too. Yeah, for me, I think I really in the end have to favor classic mode champions here that mm-hmm. that consistency is just so valuable yeah uh it really really makes a big difference to mm-hmm. just be able to rely on anybody on your team uh no matter the situation yeah but it's it's hard it's hard to say because um like third wheels have uh have sonic who's been uh amazing if a bit uh annoying to watch <laughs> um uh, they've got they've got Snake, who's been a nearly impenetrable wall, <clears throat> and uh, and their other characters are pretty solid too. Yeah, that's, so, yeah. So, like, I mean... If they get Snake, Sonic, and one more win, then they've got this. But I don't know. So like, yeah. uh, looking at this. Uh, uh, first matchup of the week is uh, Ryu versus Donkey Kong. Yeah, I, I mean these are both very good characters. Mm-hmm. Uh, 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 both, both, both characters with Gold Mario. <laughs> yeah, um, I mean both are kind of those slower, heavier characters that like to just, you know, just like to kind of win through brute force. Uh, yeah just getting in close and it really is it really feels like an appropriate matchup in that way that these guys these are probably going to be two characters just getting in each other's faces yeah so it'll be interesting to see how they uh do that uh but without further ado i suppose uh third field versus classic mode champions ryu versus donkey kong let's go Yeah, so we're on a uh, third wheels home map. Uh, they mm. got a higher spot in the. Uh, they got the higher seed because they were eliminated more recently. You know, they, they were uh, up mm-hmm. until up until last week. They were uh, tied with Musketeers in uh, playoff standings. Yeah, and I mean already you can just see the effect on those from those gold Mario's on these two, just not really moving much outside of uh, when Donkey Kong is, is using his throws. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, I think it, like the the difference between their builds is that Ryu has a Big B style and Donkey Kong has Strategist style. So like to a certain extent, it will depend on what uh, moves each of them use, and like yeah. whether they'll like whether Ryu will be fighting more in the air, whether Donkey Kong will be using his specials. <clears throat> and. And right now, it looks like Donkey Kong has started to uh, control the match a bit more over Ryu. But even still, I mean, they both just were wailing on each other so much. Donkey Kong is at uh, a little bit above 80% himself. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, I, I could easily see Ryu uh, t- taking Donkey Kong, 
taking Donkey Kong out first, or at the very least, like getting some strong damage on Donkey Kong before taking him out, before he gets taken out. Yeah. I mean, both of these characters are above 100%, definitely within kill range. Uh, yeah, and, it's really... And both are pretty close to their final smashes right now. Uh, Ryu's... Yeah, Ryu's just got his. Uh, uh, oh, he uses the big Hadouken. That's still enough to kill, though, and loses Donkey Kong yeah. half his smash meter. Yeah, but even still... I mean, we're still just... Ryu's at a oh, and that, Ryu there, lived there like hundred eighty percent there. So yeah, the uh, gold Mario is really yeah, helping I mean, him out, and the and the extra weight from Big B style. Yeah, Ryu, neither of these characters are. You can see right now, neither of these characters are going to be dying uh, easily. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I think I think what Donkey Kong's game plan is right now is he wants to get some some more hits. In on Ryu before uh, he gets his final smash. That way, uh, he can be uh, uh, more sure that his final smash is going to kill. 65 might be enough. I mean, with with Ryu's uh, Big B style, I don't know. Yeah, it's really. I mean, Ryu's got some good percentage. Uh, Donkey Kong, is Donkey Kong really... gonna let it go? This is really he gonna be go his to best waste. time to. By Donkey Kong, that was really going to be his best time to just finally take out Ryu's stock and get a lead. Instead, he's going to have to struggle to kill Ryu. I mean, yeah, he's got, we he's saw last have, time he he's going to have to dodge or tank another one of Ryu's final smashes, and that's not a place you want to be in. He gets hit by the Big Hadouken. Is this enough to kill? It is. That's enough to kill again. But again, we're seeing Ryu at almost 150 percent. Mm -hmm. And I think that's it. Yeah, that that back air is yeah. enough to kill him. Again, we're look and again things are just totally tied up. Uh, Donkey Kong has a bit more to his final smash meter, but even then, he's not that close to having it all the way filled up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and that, that's that's the problem. And, and like, I mean, it, even if Donkey Kong uh, gets his filled up. Like, is he going to waste it again, or is he going to be able to use it to hit Ryu? Yeah, I mean, just look at this. They're just really continuing to brawl it out. And it's it's really bad. Oh, Donkey Kong has his final smash at the ready. Ryu could kill him if before he gets a chance to use it, though. If Donkey Kong can get this off, though, it should be enough to kill. Mm -hmm. But he didn't even use his last one. Yeah, and he's he's... Like, he wants to combo into it, but the gold Mario, like, w isn't letting him use combos, and he's about to waste it again. It's gone. Oh my goodness. I, that's, that puts Ryu in a really good position. He's about to get his final smash. He has the lower percentage now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Donkey Kong needs to get the kill before Ryu gets his final smash. Yeah, uh... He's got, he's got his, uh... He's got his neutral be charged up. If, if Donkey yeah, Kong hits with it, it should do massive damage. That could be enough to kill. That has a lot of damage and a lot of knockback. Oh, yeah. but Ryu with the combo Oof. from from the focus punch into uh into uh, I think Tatsunaki. Uh, I don't know the names of Ryu's moves. His side B, <laughs> I believe he used. I wasn't paying much oh. yeah. <laughs> Don't say that on stream. <laughs> Um, now, something in, I do think something important to note there is that uh, it, it grabbing actually seemed like a very effective tool that both yeah. of these fighters had. Mm -hmm. uh, it, I don't uh, know exactly how uh, so, uh, grabs and yeah. I don't know exactly how grabs and throws interact with stuff like Gold Mario um, and yeah, Big uh, style. It, it just it just goes uh, Big B style the weight like your throws will throw uh, a shorter distance. But with Gold and Mario, it, like it just cancels out. Like it, it does. It ignores the knockback resistance. Okay. So yeah, gra grabs are a really good tool to deal with that, and they both definitely did. Donkey Kong had nine grabs and seven throws. I guess two of them, uh, Ryu got out of, and Ryu had seven grabs and five throws again. Was... Yeah, both of both of these fighters were using their grabs quite effectively. Yeah. 
It's uh, interesting that uh, Ryu takes the first round. Third Wheels is in the lead right now with one and zero. Or... Mm hmm. So, um, uh, let's move on to round two, which is, um, which is on uh, Hyrule Castle, which is, of course, a uh, Hashimo Champion stage, and it's going to be Sonic versus Link. So, what do you think about this one? I mean,. Really, anytime somebody has to be the one facing Sonic, not a particularly fun prospect uh, for that fighter. Like, he's built on healing, and he's fast, small, and hard to hit. Mm -hmm. Um, what kind of build is Link on? Uh, da damage dealing, damage, damage, damage. Damage dealing. Uh, which, demon style, a zero I mean, goal again. Very, very high damage. Yeah, I mean. If there's a potential counter to Sonic here, I think it is Link. Um, but this is also a big stage. It's easy to get away from your opponent and to heal up here. Mm -hmm. So really, like, I mean, it comes. This is what it comes down to with a lot of healing builds: is how much pressure can you keep on them to stop their healing? Yeah, and I feel like, I feel like as big as this stage is, there's also a lot of potential for really high damage in combos. That's true. I mean, under the little tower, you can really get somebody in a combo in there. And Link has a number of good multi-hit moves that could potentially uh, be exploited in a place like that. Yeah. He's got his bombs that could, like, keep Sonic from running away. All sorts of stuff. So, um, I suppose the only way to find out is to watch. Yeah, Sonic versus that makes Link. sense to me. <laughs> Alright, so Sonic versus Link... Classic mode champion stage, which is Hyrule Castle. And, uh, alright, that's that's a place to put your bomb, I guess, off the stage. Yeah, I mean, listen, if once it's gone, he can make a new one faster. True. And yeah, right, right now, um, Link is having a bit of trouble hitting Sonic, which is kind of how it goes. Mm-hmm. Ah... Uh, yeah, and it, Link is staying in the center of the stage, which is probably the worst area of the stage for him to be in when facing somebody like Sonic. Yeah, like, he, he needs to get, like, to either of those sides. Either of those sides will be much yeah. better positions for Link. So you can, like, because yes. there are, like, walls, and here's there's a ledge for Link to mess with Sonic on. Yeah, and... So it, this, Sonic is actually staying pretty aggressive against Link. He is running. He is just running back and forth, hitting him, taking pot shots against the guy. And Link just doesn't seem to be able to hit Sonic back well enough. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, he's gotten Sonic. I mean, he's been able to get Sonic at least over the forty percent mark, which is more than I can, than we can say for some other fighters that we've seen. Yes, uh, that, <laughs> that is true. Um, let's. I mean, it's. I mean, Link's just having a bit of a hard time hitting Sonic. It's hard to. Yeah, I mean, and that's what it always seems to come down to against Sonic, especially is just. His opponents can't hit yeah, him. I, I mean, Link's attacks are like slow, and they're not like massively big hitboxes, like, like, like sort of your King Dedede's or whatever. Yeah. Oh, and Sonic with his final this, smash. Oh, yeah, that Link. yeah that kills. Yeah. Uh, Link's about to get his final smash though, and if you can just get a little bit more damage on Sonic. Oh. Yeah, I mean Sonic. He's gotten Sonic up to uh, a pretty good damage. I mean, when Link is landing hits, you see Sonic. Sonic's not taking them well. Mm -hmm. His damage goes up fast on Sonic. Yeah. It's just... It's, it's just that Link has trouble dealing those hits. Alright, so he has his final smash. If he uses this, and if he connects with this, this will this will be... Oh, but he misses! Oh, he just misses that it! That could have been the kill, too. That, that would almost certainly have been the kill. Uh... Sonic was hovering about 85%. Yeah. It would have been pretty impressive if Sonic had lived that. Mm -hmm. yeah. But even, even still, Sonic... Style. Even still, I would say Sonic is about in kill percent for Link if he can just get a good hit in. Yeah, like his dash attack was pretty good. Maybe like a smash attack or, or yeah. up or down air. 
something. Mm-hmm. Link's doing a decent job at staying at relatively low percent until he can kill Sonic, which is good. He's yeah. Making sure uh, Sonic stays above 100. <laughs> using the, ar using yeah, the arrows I mean, to shut down Sonic's uh, roll, which is fun. Yeah, uh, he's done that a few times, I feel like, already, and it's actually been very effective. Sonic's has forward air a lot, and it's just been a great way for him to rack up the damage against Link, mm -hmm. though. And, um, yeah, this, this isn't very good, though, because Link's above 60% now. Like, Sonic's been comboing with his aerials. Yeah, Sonic is close. And Sonic's close to his final Sonic match. is close to his second final match. And, and that will kill at this percent if he, if he drags him to the top. Yeah, I mean, Link has been... Link has been keeping Sonic at a high percentage, which is good, but he just can't seem to oh, land a killing blow. Yeah, he dodges the final smash wow. enough. Well, I got hit twice. That was that was very impressive. But Link still needs a pretty big comeback here if he's gonna take this game away from Sonic. Yeah, and, and if I don't know if Classic Mode Champions lose this, uh, I'm I'm they're at a yeah. Uh, I'm not I'm not so yeah. sure about them because Donkey Kong and Link are their two strongest. Yeah, I mean. If Classic Mode Champions lose this, I just can't see them winning because it will be extremely difficult for them to beat Snake. Yeah, yeah I mean, if Yo if Yoshi pulls out a miracle and beats Snake, then I can see um, then I can see the final two matches going in Classic Mode Champions' favor. But all right, anyway, Link's at his final smash. Does he connect? He does. That kills. He does finally, but he's kills, so but far behind. That He's at 140%, basically, compared to Sonic's fresh second stock. Mm -hmm. Um... I mean... Like, he, he's, get, he's getting decent damage now that we're in the tent, but, yeah. like... And, and we, we've, yeah, I mean, seen, we've seen Link survive past 200. Yeah, I mean, that t that tent, uh, tower, whatever you want to call it, is really the area that Link wants to hang out. It's not it's not that easy for Sonic to kill him around there, but it's easy for Link to rack up the damage against yeah. Sonic. Oh, and um, it's probably not going to be good uh, in a few seconds. No, Sonic's almost got his final smash ready again. Yeah. <clears throat> And there, there goes Link. Didn't use oh, it, which did. means, which means uh, thankfully that Sonic's final smash will probably go to waste. It won't kill Link. I'll just do like a little bit of damage. But it could, this is still some easy damage for Sonic. Yeah, eighteen percent. It's pretty solid. I mean, that's yeah. Oh, and yeah, like they're they're even percent to... right now. But Link's a stock behind. He needs to. He needs to start getting hits in on Sonic and not let himself get hit so much. Now, I don't want to totally count Link out here because he is a good fighter and he can do very impressive things, but this is just a big deficit for him to have it for him to try and come back from. <clears throat> and uh, Link, Link's so far taking the percent lead. I mean, he's still a stock behind, but he's, you know, got that going for him at least. Yeah. And he's almost at his final smash, which means, um, like, he, he could theoretically kill Sonic right now and even up the stocks. Oh, he's pushing Sonic off the stage! Oh, wait, he's, he, he's he pushing going Sonic to get... off the stage! He gets Link the is... He Link his is... Final smash almost ready. He could do this! Link is... Yes, Link. That was a very impressive. He just completely shut down Sonic uh -oh. from recovering uh -oh. back to stage. Oh no! Oh. Well, Sonic decided to repay the favor. Yeah. <laughs> Still, that was. This, this is, does not look good for Classic Mode Champions. No, this is not a good situation to be in. Uh. I mean, I will say, I think if they can pull out the upset, uh, I think if they can pull up the upset against Snake, they have a very real chance. 
I feel like, uh, I mean, Sonic and Snake are definitely third wheels, two best yeah. characters. And I feel like Ryu is potentially their mm-hmm. third best, even. So there's a very real possibility that Classic Mode Champions could run this back, but it's not looking good. It's going to be a very, very big uphill yeah. battle. Sonic recovered more damage than he dealt. Yeah, that sounds about right. I mean, once Link... Once Link... Link did start to deal some good damage to Sonic there after a little bit of a rough mm-hmm. start. It's just that he fell behind and he was having trouble getting some... Killing Sonic's first yeah. stock. Yeah, I mean... So, anyway, Snake versus Yoshi... Um, Classic Mode Champions bringing in Yoshi, who's uh, technically their worst character, I think, but uh, for Classic Mode Champions, I think he's basically tied with Fox. Yeah, I think... I do think Yoshi is... I mean, like everybody on Classic Mode Champions, I still think Yoshi is a pretty good fighter. Uh, Snake is 100% the favorite character here, but Yoshi is a character who I could see being able to get the upset (laughs) i mean his build is interesting he's got gravity style and ho which means he won't have trouble uh uh, as much falling off of vigisil's altar Hmm. Uh, but but snake but i feel like such a solid recovery with that super armor and that big uh is it it a camera that he grabs but (laughs) it's like a drone camera anyway (laughs) It's, yeah, it's hard to say that Yoshi will be able to take this. Yeah, and I don't know how... Well, I think Yoshi's build is interesting and has and definitely has application and good usage that could happen out of it. I don't know if it's the right type of build when you're facing a character like mm-hmm. Snake. So, um, yeah, let's get it started. All right. Okay, they are off the stage at the moment. Oh, oh, what? What is? Yoshi makes it back. Does there Snake make no... it back? He does. I, I would be amazed. If, yes, I would be amazed if Snake make it back. Um, yeah, I mean, I mean, Yoshi was trying to <laughs> trying to get that to happen. Like bless bless his little yeah, heart. Yeah, he wanted that. <laughs> yeah. I mean, listen, it's a very good way to start the match off if you can just gimp your opponent out of a stock when the platform yeah. leaves. And right now, he's in the percent lead. I mean, who knows how long that'll yeah, last, I'm... but, like, he's in the percent lead. Yeah, I mean... Oh, and now he's not. And now he's not. And now he's dead. Mm-hmm. Nope. Yeah, I mean, that's really just the danger of Snake, is he just really combos. <laughs> he oh, can just and combo here we go. you like that. Here come the missiles. And there's it his won't, final smash. Unless, unless Yoshi no, it... goes up to the top of the stage. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, still, that was an easy 14% for Snake to get on Yoshi, but Yoshi could get a kill on Snake here yeah. uh, yeah, pretty I mean, soon. Ide- ideally, he'll get, a, he'll get a kill and be able to save his final smash for the next stock. But if he has to use his final smash to get yeah. a kill, that wouldn't be so bad either. I, one thing I didn't even consider oh, about Yoshi's build okay. is that Yoshi has... Okay. okay, but Yoshi's already back up to almost At 90%. Now. He's already... Oh my uh, god. Use your final... Nope, it's gone. Nope. Uh, no Yoshi yeah. stampede. Um, That might... I mean, that's just the danger of Snake. It's, Yoshi went from, like, 20% to 100% in a second, yeah, it felt like. His, like. his attacks just do so much damage. Yeah. And, of course, that, like, with Demon Style, like, that comes with the danger of, like, Snake takes damage, too. Like, Snake is such a heavy character. But he's a heavy character with an incredibly good recovery. So that's a, that's a very well worthwhile trade-off on a character yeah. like Snake. He can afford to take that extra damage. You don't want to stand there. Oh, Yoshi he shields it and let Snake take the full hit of that. And he, this, this is going to kill him. But This is going to kill him, but Yoshi managed to make that second stock very 
very worthwhile in the end, getting Snake up to 70, a bit over 75%. Yeah, Yoshi is doing something that uh, more characters uh, really should do, is let Snake get hit by his own attacks. Because <laughs> he can do that. Yes. Um, the other thing that I'm realizing is Yoshi's build is really letting Yoshi take advantage of his mm -hmm. strong air game. Which, to be um, fair, and, Snake's aerials are well, pretty Snake, strong too, but that, but like he he can't really use his side B in the air the, uh, effectively, and like he doesn't like using his neutral B in the air, and his down B doesn't really work in the air. But and on top of that, though, is that uh, Yoshi, while Snake has strong aerials, the hitboxes on Yoshi's aerials are extremely good. But Yoshi's back up to almost 100% again, and he hasn't been able to take this stock uh, off of Snake. And, like, he's about to get his final smash, which, like, yay, like, that could that could lead to, like, the, the stock finishing, but, like... Yeah, Yoshi would have really oh, needed to have killed Snake uh, earlier and had racked up some percentage. Instead, it's... Instead, Snake is at 161% and still and, living. And Snake's about to get his final smash, too. Yoshi needs to get hit... Get that kill. Yeah. He connects. He connects, so he does get a kill. Yeah, and, um, oh. But I, if it had just been one more hit, then Snake would have lost half his final smash charge, but now Yoshi is dead. Yeah, I. <laughs> yeah, this uh, is. Unless this is Yoshi the end does of something amazing. He didn't do something amazing. <laughs> Has any character managed to dodge that final uh, smash? No. Uh, like m maybe like stage jank, they were able to like hide under a ceiling, but not on that stage. No, uh, and that's it. In the end, third wheel ended up three zero in classic mode yeah. champions. A dominating victory from uh, third wheels. Although I will say, not a bad performance from Yoshi. No, not at all. I think Yoshi actually looked. I think Yoshi. Honestly, all all three of these matches were actually quite good and overall fairly close matches. Um, the worst the worst uh, matchup was really Link versus Sonic, but even that, considering how dominant Sonic has been, Link was looking pretty good out there. Uh huh. Yeah, and like um, Link was able to bring it to a last stock situation. Like he he played that. Not not many characters would be yeah. able to do that. No, I mean, uh, Sonic's been an extremely strong opponent, both in the main season and in the mm -hmm. postseason. Um, and it just even keeping up with him the way Link was able to was very impressive. Anyway, um, that's it for uh, this episode, and that's it for uh, basically the playoffs. Uh, all we have left are the championship matches. So... Uh, uh, just so just a reminder um so there's the extra modes which is a uh, king of smash and a uh, kaiju league there's a channel that explains both of those rules um the builds for those are uh, due on thursday uh the uh 16th 16th yeah 16th uh, yeah. thursday the right. 16th and yep. um and of course for third wheels and musketeers uh your builds are also due on the 16th now um Keep in mind that uh, the the championship match won't be uh, uh, live on the uh, 18th. It'll it'll go live a week later uh, because um, uh, we're going to be uh, spent spending time. Uh, uh, all, all the commentators want to get together for that, uh, so we're going. And there's a lot of you know there's a lot of stuff to record, so we're just going to sort of be taking the a uh, week to record and edit. <laughs> Yeah, we're going to be, uh, you know, making sure we take our time a bit more uh, recording the finals and all the extra events that are coming with it so that we can really put out the best yeah. product we can for you all. So, um, yeah, that's uh, it for the week. Uh, see you all mm -hmm. some other time. Uh, yeah, see you yeah. all for the finals. Bye. Yeah. Bye.